Well, I woke him up at 5.30, and I stood in the doorway, LaFrance, you know, it's, it's that time to get up. And he, as always, yes, ma'am, and crawl up out the bed. And that was the last time I saw him. The two brothers, you know, one would never be here, and the other one would never be the same. And that's something he would have to deal with the rest of his life. So basically, you took a life, and you're taking part of another life by not just locking it up. Just heartbreaking, um, just, just it's all over again. Um, just how these things can be prevented, you know. I think having more conversations with kids, um, they're very, very smarter than what we believe. Um, not only locking these guns, but you know, just, just talking to them, educating them about them, you know, these aren't toys. <sighs> I felt like I, I, uh, I did a great job, but I went wrong somewhere. So, uh, just loving on your babies and just talking to them and um, checking on them and just, uh, just, they're not going to tell everything. We just have to monitor them more go behind them more, being aware of their friends and what their friends like.